What's poppin' homies, it's your boy Frank Nitty back in the building, back in the culture closet, back bringing you guys a throwback video. I know today is Thursday, and um, I had some old footage when I came back from England, and I went to New York. Uh, this is the footage from Sneakers and Stuff, my first time ever visiting a brick and mortar Sneakers and Stuff. Usually I do all my shopping out from the website, like overseas in Sweden, I think that's where they at, Stockholm. I believe, man. I have came up a lot on sneakers and stuff, like finding great deals, find out uh, shoes that I couldn't get here in the United States, sometimes even cheaper. Like, I'll buy a pair of Jordan 1s, and they'll only charge you like $10 for um, shipping and handling, even though it's coming from way overseas. But nevertheless, man, they opened a spot in Chelsea Market. That's in Manhattan, if you guys don't know. I pulled up to the spot, found a little bit of heat, but I left it on the shelf, man. So if y'all in New York, y'all visit there frequently, I got you. I left it there for y'all. But anyways, man, stay tuned. Watch the video. Hope you like it. Peace. So right now we're in front of Sneakers and Stuff. About going inside, see what's popping. Apparently it's in Chelsea Market, man, which I did not know. Or AKA Google's property. Oh, and your boy did pick up some stuff. Yeah. These are dope. I like these joints right here, man. I like them a lot better than these. But I don't got them yet. But I'm going to try to get them. Element 87s. It's a Jordan table. You got all three snake skins. 185 for these joints. You still got this joint. Isn't this the Atmos? It's still available. I'm not sure what size this is or what other sizes they have, but it's sitting on the table, man. Or whatever you want to call this piece. Marachi joints. I like the colorways on this. What's the price? One twenty-five. That is dope. This is dope. I like this colorway. The waffle jumps. Okay, they got Sean Paul playing in the background. I remember him, early two thousand dancehall reggae. Okay, you got these madness. Who's buying these, bro? Let me know. Who's buying these? Either colorway. I'm a I like black, but I don't think I'll pick either of these up, bro. It's not my steez. Flight posits on deck. I might even show the meaning of this shoe, bro. I'm not sure if this, yeah, I just, I don't even know enough to even talk about it. So we'll just put it down. Well, I know they're available everywhere if y'all want them. Mash it up. And it got in the case. I wonder what kind of car this was. Got a New York license plate. Yo, they got these Reebok pumps. Are they called flurry, furries, furries? Flurries, they're going for 179, man. I I'm not opposed to this shoe. I mean, stylistically, I mean, I don't know. I don't know if this is gonna be the move in the future, but I'm not mad at it. I don't know if I would rock it because I don't think I could pull it off. Okay, camouflage joint, Tokyo joint. This says distracto. I'm not even sure if that's supposed to be a word or not. But anyways, man, the Sean Kemp's. I think that's what they are. More Reeboks. I like the colorways, but that's about it. Yo, there's a lot of dope apparel in here, bro. I actually like this joint right here. It's a leather jacket, even though it'll never get this hot in Florida. Get that cold in Florida, rather. I'm not mad at it, man. It's actually their own brand, SNS, or maybe the collab. Oh, it's a Vans jacket, Vans leather. Yo, it's not that bad, bro. You got this uh, purple velour. You got this uh, hash gray, soft white ish SNS jump shoot. All velour. Another jumper or a jacket, spring jacket, lightweight jacket. All SNS. Got this uh, Carhartt. Fila, but not the Fila y'all know, man. It's like a nylon material. Y'all remember nylon, man? Back in the 90s, early 2000s, we rock nylon. More Carhartt. These are t-shirts, man, multiple colors. T-shirts like ranging like 45 and up, man. They got the long sleeve joint right here. Maybe a collab. Arm fatigue jacket. All right. All right, all right. Then you got the overall joint right here. You see that Carhartt symbol in the back? Not mad at it. Also, you got the big pun clothing brand. Look at the big pun, bro. 
that's dope. I think they want 85 for that. Then they got the regular tees, big pun, or black, and then you got the shirt in white. Then you got pleasure. It's going for 80, $45 actually for that tee. I actually saw another big pun. Yeah, it's like New York Knicks colorway Punisher. That's dope. Then you got more pleasure up here. I'm not sure what's pleasure. You guys would know that better than I would. But they also got this Adidas. I think it's Adidas. Yeah, it says pleasure on the on the side. And boss, pleasures. I actually like this shoe right here, man. This is dope. This is Adidas though. No boost. I think it's Adidas. Yeah, it says Adidas. And it's a uh, torsion. That's the cushioning that they use, I believe, right? Yeah, it's the cushioning they use. Dope shoe. I like it. They got multiple colors. You got the Beastie Boys uh, sweater, bro. This is thick, bro. Like, like pause. Like, material-wise, this is thick. Is that, what says New York? Is that Knicks? That looks like, uh, who's a point guard for Knicks back in the days, man? I can't call his name. That looks like him. <laughs> I'll post his name if I, if I can figure it out. T-shirts is also thick. Pause. Beastie Boys. Multiple colors. You got the white joint here. Oh, the back is crazy, too, man. Look at that. They got the tapes back in the days when you used to buy cassette tapes. This is how this would come, bro. That's dope. That's dope. Uh, black tee. This is all the Beastie Boys right here. They're going for $45 for the t-shirt and $85 for the, the sweaters. Yo, this is dope, bro. This is dope. Yo, check this one out. Fred Friendstones. That's crazy. Is it supposed to be Levi's? Yeah, Levi's premium jacket. This is hitting for 128. Not bad, man. Not bad. I mean, opposed to like, that's what the Levi's charge and could be a collab. Not bad. Adidas in the building. Prime knit. I'm not even sure what these are, though. I'm not sure if it's like the Game of Thrones joints. But they look comfortable as hell, though, man. I like them. I like this style. I like this black and white joint. It's not bad. Yo, that's crazy. I got the light. Welcome back, guys, man. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it was a short video, but that's a video I had in the shoot, man. It was just sitting there, and I was like, yo, I need to post this, man. So, I call it the Throwback Thursday joint, man. It's like two weeks old, but it was my first time there, so it was about the experience for me. But anyways, man, I got two new unboxings, man. I'm not sure how long this video is. I know it's short. Uh, you know what? i say it for the next video, man. If y'all come back tomorrow, Friday, I'm going to show y'all the contents in this box because these shoes... I haven't even released yet, man. So I'm gonna sprint to y'all the unboxing. Y'all like, yo, if they're not released, how you gotta just do it? <laughs> theft box. <laughs> These are the theft Nike box. And yes, they did came from Nike. And yes, they're unreleased. Y'all probably know what it is. But anyways, man, stay tuned. See y'all tomorrow. I hope y'all enjoy this video. I hope you guys enjoy future videos. I hope you guys enjoy my current spot, my new lighting, and my new microphone, man. If not, it only gonna get better, man. So be patient. Man, if y'all like what you just saw, you know, if you like to see my throwback videos, if you just want me to post videos from my experience in different stores, different cities, different locations, I will continue to do so, so long as you guys continue to watch, man. Until then, until we meet again, until I'm in front of this lens and behind or in front of your screens, you guys already know my slogan. Good to go. It's a wrap.